Hi guys, I thought I'd make a quick video on how I roll paper cartridges for a Civil War reenacting. Been doing this uh, since 1995, rolled a lot of cartridges. So I thought I'd just show you how I do it. Uh, the supplies you need, you need some newsprint, paper of some sort. Uh, you need your powder flask. That's uh, got 3F black powder in it and a 60 grain uh, spout. I've also cut out these blocks. These are cut out of 2x6s. And they have 5 in, five eighths inch holes drilled into it. And this is the, the dimensions of it right here. And as you can see, that's used as a guide to cut out your paper. Okay, there's the dimensions. Right. So, what you do is you uh, trace out the paper cut a bunch of them out so you have a bunch ready to go right here and then you need this dowel this is a half inch dowel and I've drilled out the end of this so it's got a concave hole in it both ends this is about nine inches long or so seems to be about right so you got the dowel you got the paper you take the paper hold it like that you put the dowel on the bottom and you leave about a half inch gap right here. Okay. Then just roll it up. This is easier to do when you don't have a camera in front of you. Roll this up like that. Then you take that end and you just twist it like this. And you push that into the concave end like that. And then that, uh, that tube will stay together. Pull that out. There you go. You're ready to go. Now, you got to put gunpowder in it. Got your powder flask. Open up the valve. Put your finger over the end. Turn it upside down. Let go of the valve. And then you're going to have 50 grains of gunpowder. 60, sorry. 60 grains of gunpowder there. Fill up the tube. Like that. You repeat that process several hundred times, and then you've got a bunch of tubes full of gunpowder, and you got to fold it up. What I do is take and flatten out, you can feel where the gunpowder is at the bottom, flatten that out, and then I take and fold it 90 degrees like that fold it flat, pinch it. You got that. And then you fold it over again so it's pointing the other way. Like that. And then fold it down. Like that. So you're folding it three times. Okay. Sometimes I bend this tip over. I think it holds it together better. Okay. And that's basically it right there. What you can do, if you don't like that paper tail sticking out. You can just cut that off with a pair of scissors. And that keeps it a little more compact. And that's really about it. Just do that a bunch of times. Put it in your cartridge box. And then you can just rip that off when you're ready. Here's your powder. That's it. Pretty simple. But you're going to have to use a lot of these because you're going to be shooting a bunch if you're a Civil War reenactor. Uh, that's it. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you again.